All right, good morning, everyone. I am very excited to be here to speak to everyone as part of One Million Cups. Um, my name is Amy Underwood, and I am the owner of Health Elevated. It is a private pelvic health practice. Um, and my tagline is rediscover a life without limits and feel free to be yourself again. So I'm gonna dive right in. Who am I and what on earth is pelvic health? Uh, because a lot of the time this is something that we don't often talk about. So I am an occupational therapist. I have been in the field of healthcare for um, almost 20 years now. And I work primarily in physical rehabilitation. I graduated from Trinity College Dublin in 2005 with a Bachelor's of Science in Occupational Therapy, um, which now if you meet an occupational therapist who's graduated from WMU, they will have a doctorate. So I'm grandfathered in. Um, in 2006, I emigrated from Ireland to the United States. Uh, my visa was sponsored by a company called Health South, um, and I worked in Morgantown, West Virginia for quite a few years. Um, I don't know if any of you remember Richard Scrushy. He was the owner of Health South and got into quite a bit of trouble with the IRS. Um, so that was my first experience moving to the US. <laughs> so since 2006, I have lived and worked across the United States, starting in Morgantown, uh, West Virginia. I moved to Chicago, Illinois. From Chicago, Illinois, I moved to Maui, Hawaii. Hawaii to New Jersey and New Jersey to Michigan. Um, and in that time, I have worked in every healthcare field you can imagine, hospitals, long-term care facilities, skilled nursing homes, home healthcare, and outpatient rehabilitation. In 2018, I was working in an outpatient rehabilitation center focusing mostly with picky eaters, so <coughs> kids who are really struggling with eating a wide variety of foods. And what I noticed was a lot of these picky eaters were also problem poopers. They were constipated. Um, and as a therapist, I wanted to figure out a solution to this problem, so I discovered that as a therapist, I can actually address constipation, and there's lots of different ways to do that. So that brought me down a path of working in the field of pelvic health, and I started with pediatrics, pediatrics which is not the typical way to go about it, but it worked for me. Um, fast forward to 2021, and I broadened my focus and started working not only with children with pelvic health concerns, but also with adults. So what is pelvic health? Well, our pelvic floor muscles are muscles that live in between our pubic bone, our tailbone, and our sit bones on either side. And they work with our core, which is our abdominals, our diaphragm, and our low back. And all these muscles have to be able to work together as part of a system. So just like any other muscle in your body, your pelvic floor muscles have to be able to contract and relax. If they're not able to do that or don't coordinate well, they are going to present with pelvic floor dysfunction. So that can be constipation, trouble with peeing, painful sex, or even erectile dysfunction. So as much as I'd love to talk about pelvic health, I'm gonna talk about my business, because that's why we're here. So Health Elevated started in March of 2021 as a partnership with another pelvic health therapist, a colleague of mine, and we started really as a focus of doing online courses and workshops to educate more women about pelvic health, and especially pregnancy and postpartum. Over the course of several months, um, we discovered that women really weren't interested in workshops. They wanted one-on-one -on -one care. They wanted to talk about these things, not in a group. And what we did was we pivoted, and I started offering one-on-one um, -on -one care in a office in St. Joe, Michigan. What makes Health Elevated different is that we are a cash-based practice. So that means I don't work with insurance, you pay me directly, so I'm an out-of-network provider. Um, moving forward again, so I was doing one day a week. Um, in April of 2023, I reached out to SCORE thinking, I really need to learn more about marketing. I want to like start being more intentional about my business and marketing it a bit better. Um, and I was connected with my awesome SCORE mentor, Pete. And after several conversations, I realized that I really didn't need help with marketing, I needed help understanding the business of business. Because as good as I am as a clinician, I do not understand business whatsoever. So that was really a big milestone for Health Elevated. In June of 2023, Stacy and I decided to dissolve our partnership. She actually now um, owns a Big B. She's uh, bought in, she and her husband bought into that franchise. So her attention went another direction, but I really wanted to move Health Elevated forward. So we dissolved the partnership and I reestablished it as a solo PLLC. 
Um, and I added a second day in my private practice. So I went from one day a week and I doubled my volume to two days a week of seeing patients in, um, in St. Joe. By August, which is this month, um, with the help of Pete, I have actually re, um, re-upped my, my whole pricing structure. I understand my business a whole lot better and I have a lot more reasons why I price things the way I priced, whereas when I started it really was, I kind of picked a number, said this is how much I'm going to charge and went with that. <laughs> um, apparently that's not how you're supposed to do things. <laughs> <laughs> um, my goal is in by December of 2023 that I will be full time in my private practice. So working there five days a week. Uh, currently I do work part time for a large local hospital. <laughs> um, so that is my plan. So I'm, in order to do this, to get to this place where I'm working full time in my practice, there is a new brand message and a new logo coming soon. Um, but really my, my brand messaging is no more missed adventures. Custom pelvic health therapy that helps you regain control, confidence and comfort so that you can stop worrying and start living. So these are my questions. How can you guys help? <laughs> yeah.